how does can you just tell us real briefly how 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 do they make a boot using this? Sure. Do they, do they what do they do with the leather? Well, we have there's a number of steps that that go in. For example, let me just grab a boot here. This this boot has a stitch pattern on the top and on the vamp. So this will go into a computerized room. That we they used to do this by hand, but it wasn't nearly as nice. Mm -hmm. I can uh, imagine. So now they can take this in and, and uh, uh, put it on a computer a stitch stitching machine. And we'll have I think we have like twelve of those machines in the factory, and they can turn out those and really make them pretty pretty nice. Um, this is called the vamp, and this is we call this the quarters or the shaft. Um, this is the heel counter. Um, what they do is they start out with a, they take they take a skin. We should grab one of those skins there, and they take a skin. And we have dies. And we, we have what we call a clicker. So if you if you can visualize putting this under here and, and pulling that over, well, we have to click that off, uh, and then you have to match this skin with the, the right one here to the left one. So you, this will take two skins to make this pair of boots. Okay. Okay. Okay, and then. Once they put that dial, figure out exactly where they're going to cut it. Uh, they they put that on there, put the clicker on it, stamps it out, and now you got a piece of leather like this. Right. That will go actually over here. And this is when they pull this over. These guys, you really have to see them in action because they they put this between their legs, and every one of them is a little bit different. So a handmade boot is going to fit. Not I've got 40 pair or something. And they will fit, every one of them will fit a little bit different because mm -hmm. those guys are hand latching it. They pull this around and they'll have it up like this. And they pull these around. I don't know if you can see that. But they pull these around and they keep these tacks in their mouth and they tack this okay. leather down. Okay. And then they'll, then they'll sew the welt on that. And then they'll put the, the insole on it and then trim that off. And I, I'm, I'm not a bootmaker, so there's a, there's a lot there's a hundred steps, and I'm not smart enough to remember. Yeah, this is, but this is yeah, general. Idea. General, yeah. general yeah. thing is that they'll take this and pull this over over the boot like this, mm -hmm. and that's where. It, of course, this will already have the shaft on it when they start lasting. All of our boots are hand lasted. All of them are wet lasted. So they're the, the, this skin is actually in a bucket of water. Is that right? Yeah. Okay. So, okay. <clears throat> so that's just one of the steps. Uh, to so go through the, the hot house and stays in the hot house for 24 hours at least. Okay. So form to this. Okay. All right. So when you put it on, the boot should fit perfectly when you put it on, not when you throw it away. <laughs> it's a good way. Okay. <laughs> well, I know I got a pair of Lucchese boots, and that's the only pair that I like. I like to put on. Okay. I mean, they're comfortable at the end, of, as comfortable at the as the end of the day as they are at the beginning of the sure. day. Sure. So, um, Bill, that's very good. Um, I think that uh, gives us an idea on how, how the boots are made and, and particularly how Lucchese boots are made.